In this lesson, I'll show you two examples on how to calculate the correct day supply for a medicine. Question one reads, how many days should the following prescription last? So let's take a look. We have Pamelor, 75 milligrams. Pamelor is a medicine used to treat symptoms of depression. And we're told PO bid, which means orally, and BID represents twice a day. We have to dispense 50 of these. The formula that we'll be using is the one shown underneath. The quantity to dispense over the dose times the frequency gives you the day's supply. So the quantity to dispense, according to this, is 50, while the dosage is one capsule and the frequency is twice a day. So 50 divided by 1 times 2. Dividing out these numbers gives you 25 days. So this medicine should last this person 25 days. Now the reason why this formula works is because, remember, dosage is the amount of substance administered at one time. And we're being told that it's one capsule per one dose. I mean, we're not technically told that, but we can assume that if it's not written, for example, if we're not provided this symbol or the two T's with the two dots, and we can assume that it's one. So one capsule per day, that's this number right here without the units, two represents the frequency. So twice a day, two dose per one day. Notice that by multiplying one and two, this cancels out with that. And 50 represents 50 capsules. So 50 capsules. This means that this unit will cancel out with this unit, leaving us with days. This is why we reported 25 days. In question number two, we're asked, how many days should the following prescription last? This time we have Coletra tablets, and this is a medicine used to suppress HIV, and it has a strength of the following. We're told that we have to take this orally twice a day with food, and we're expected to dispense 360 of these tablets. So let's go ahead and figure this out using the same formula as before. Day supply is equal to the quantity dispensed, 360. The dose is going to be one, as it's not stated, times the frequency twice a day. 360 divided by two gives us 180 day supply, so half a year. Now just to put this in perspective, if we had the two T's with the two dots, then our dosage would be two. 360 divided by four would give us 90 days. So you have to make sure that you read this and understand what they're telling you. And there you have it. Two more examples on how to calculate the correct day supply. 